Hola, chicas. Es miércoles. Grams. Hey, girls. It's Wednesday. And we're at Six Flags. We're going to ride this hike. Yeah. So excited. Because in the middle of this ride, we black out. So on Friday, um, my friend Doug and I went to Six Flags, and it was awesome. <laughs> So it was really great to go. I rode like almost all the roller coasters, which is awesome. I love roller coasters. So I really like uh, this week's theme. It is how did we get started with YouTube? Almost exactly four years ago, on I think October 7th, 2007, I signed up for my first YouTube channel. And a few days later, I uploaded my very first YouTube video. You can watch it here. And then I didn't do anything for like three years. So about this time last year, I was watching YouTube more, but mostly it was like viral videos and stuff, nothing too exciting. I guess I was kind of in a girly, sappy mood, so I would watch proposals and baby announcements and stuff like that, because it's really nice to see people happy about that. I don't think that's exactly the videos I was watching, but I don't remember specifically what videos I was watching, but linked, uh, you know, one of the linked videos um, was John and Hank's uh, People Who Love Giraffes Who Love Giraffes videos. So I clicked on it and I was like, what is this? And uh, it was John and then he was talking to him. It was one where he was talking and then his past John came and talked and did some stuff. I need to turn off my microwave. So past John talked and I was kind of confused and he talked kind of fast but I knew that whatever he was saying that I like something in my brain was like watch more of this this is good so I clicked on another one and then my friend Crystal was like you need to watch these and he she linked to a bunch of Henry videos so I was like well that's just the cutest baby in the world and so I I kind of I really liked their videos and for a long time I didn't know who Hank was I know that is dumb like who the F is Hank but Really, I didn't know who Hank was for a long time because um, I just somehow was linking to John videos. So I decided if I was really going to watch these guys, if I was going to commit to their channel, then I was really going to commit and I was going to become a nerd fighter. And I started at the beginning and I watched all the way through until I caught up to present time whenever that was a, like a year ago. Then from John and Hank, the next place I went to was uh, Wheezy Waiter. Some of the videos I had watched at the time talked about him. So then I went to his channel because I was like, well, you know, if the vlog brothers are awesome, then Wheezy Waiter must be awesome. Speaking of Wheezy Waiter, happy birthday, Craig! Yay! So then I started watching some of Craig's videos and, um, yeah, then I really liked that. So I did the same thing where I started back at the beginning and um, watched from the very beginning and it's really interesting to see how the two both like Wheezy Waiter and Vlogbrothers their channels have changed a lot over the past several years and then I really only watch uh, one other channel although it's kind of multiple channels but um, from Wheezy Waiter I got into Mitchell Davis and Kyle Seibert and uh, Live Lava Live did the same thing started off at the I think with this one with Live Lava Live I didn't I just watched like one or two videos but I was like no let's do it let's start right at the beginning so I started at the very, very beginning with Live Lava Live and also talk about changes in this in a thing, you know, he, they're pretty consistent, but watching them grow up, I guess for their videos, it's not changes of the video style, but more like changes in them, you know, just seeing them grow up. And I love Kyle and Mitchell. They are awesome. I just love them so much. And then I started watching Kyle's Nexus One. They're so fun. I love them. So that's me and YouTube. Oh, oh, I forgot a really important thing. So after watching the Vlogbrothers and getting the idea of, you know, communicating with um, people who you love and care about but who are not in the same city as you, I started a collab channel that failed horribly but was kind of good, you know, it was good while it lasted um, between some friends of mine. So that was my first real YouTube vlogging type stuff. 
And then I was like, you know what? This isn't going anywhere, but I still want to vlog and I still want to make videos. So on January 1st this year, I started a different channel, Gabe the Girl. And that has evolved into other things, which is cool. Although it's sucked lately because I've been too busy to do that. And then I went to VidCon and I met you awesome girls. And now we have this collab channel and it's great. I love that I'm forced to vlog at least once a week. So... Okay, that is me and YouTube, and not in a nutshell. So I gotta go edit this now, um, so that I can post it. Uh, so I'm gonna go, and Amy, I'll see you tomorrow.